I wish I got grades like that. Stayed after school so often, people thought I was the janitor. <laughs> Steph, these are terrific grades. But your teacher wrote here, Stephanie is a wonderful student, but she needs to control her talking in class. Dad, it's not my fault. Kids are always asking me for help. And who can blame them? Check out these grades. <laughs> Steph, if you're always talking during class, you might miss out on something really important. Yeah, like recess. <laughs> or reading and end writing and the fundamental thing. <laughs> Steph, you have to stop being such a little chatterbox. So, my own family thinks I'm a chatterbox? How rude. Steph. No, no, it's fine. From now on, this little chatterbox is all locked up. Stephanie, it's Mr. Malatesta, Jesse and Joey's boss. Thanks. Uh, are the fellows in? Uh, where's their office? <laughs> down through the kitchen and down the stairs. Thanks. <laughs> Just what we need in San Francisco, another mime. <laughs> Hi, Steph, how's it going? I think she's carrying this I'm not a chatterbox thing too far. Personally, I find it a refreshing change of pace. <sighs> DJ, something tells me we need to talk. There's nothing to talk about. You kissed my teacher. You kissed Mr. Zambruski? <laughs> no, I kissed Senorita Mosley. You kissed the teacher? Oops. There I go again, chattering away. Silly me. Come on, Steph. We made your all-time favorite lunch. Peanut butter, jelly, and banana. Joey, we gotta get that kid to talk. I have no idea what's going on in the first grade. Come on, Steph. I can't take the silence. Please, I miss the old chatterbox. It's your little chatter. Are you sure? Yeah, are you guys sure? We want to hear everything that happened today. I think I'll go do my Spanish homework. <laughs> okay, boys, have a seat. Okay. This morning, Mr. Gibbler ran his car over a garbage can and got TV dinner trays all over the street. You don't say. I do say. <laughs> A lion. I thought it really was a lion, but then Mrs. Norton came out and hit it on the head with a newspaper, and then it barked, so I was pretty sure it was a dog. Really? Would I make that up? <laughs> and did you hear what happened to Virginia Godding? She got five dollars from the tooth fairy. Must have been a big tooth. My teeth too small, or do I have a cheap tooth fairy? <laughs>